One of the biggest mistakes that you make as an entrepreneur is not understanding the difference between networking and positioning. It is literally costing you millions upon millions of dollars, and in my case, it could cost me hundreds of millions of dollars. So watch me behind the scenes as I use positioning versus networking to help build a $100 million business. I'm with Mike Sherman, security, Katie, security. <laughs> We're here actually for another meeting. We're not here for this meeting. We came here for another meeting. One thing inside of understanding business is the ability to network. And I think network is the wrong word. I think the word that people mistake is the difference between the word networking and the word positioning. And I think what makes me and Eddie really, really good is our ability to know how to position versus network. And the meeting I'm about to go to is a massive, massive potential deal that we're working on that I have been slowly, slowly for probably a year now positioning ourselves and aspire to get us in the right place to where this person reached out to us and this person wanted to have this meeting that we're going to and instead of me trying to network and get with them and talk to them and so forth understand the difference between networking and positioning and if more entrepreneurs are out of position versus network we get further in business god that deal with you could be so fucking wild man yeah i'm surprised you're like he jumped on that why do you know who I am? <laughs> do you know? Who do you think you are? I am! Do you know how good I close? <laughs> I close to close That was a lay down. Lay down? It's a lay down because how smooth I am. That All the things good. I'm saying was like positioning, positioning, positioning. I tell the story and I say the exact things I know he wants to hear. You just so happen automatically fit exactly what you need. Oh my God. What's the odds? A hundred fucking percent they do because I did it that way. Most entrepreneurs, as you talk to them, they're always talking about you got to get in the right rooms, you got to get in the right rooms. Getting in the right rooms is not actually the key to the success. What I'm looking for is finding a type of individuals that I would like to pursue maybe some type of business relationship with. But what I do is I make sure that I get myself positioned with them, create an environment where I can get a five minute, a 10 minute possible conversation, understand what they do already, and I begin to ask them questions more in depth about what it is that they do. Part of it is they're almost intrigued by, hey, this guy actually took the time and actually knows about what I do. I understand that I'm not gonna talk about my product or my business. I'm going to lead with questions about what they're doing and then never make them an offer. I put the bait out in the water of what it is that we do that I know that they're interested in and then I walk away from it. That's gonna attract them to me. That's the difference between networking and positioning with purpose. Get him, Gabe. You don't fucking waste my time. <laughs> don't go on fucking green. You blow them up. <laughs> you don't fucking wait around. We went 12 feet, too. You know what I mean? We're like, wow. On the plane, she was like, well, you grabbed Andrew's bags. Why didn't you grab mine? I did not say that. <laughs> wow. Do not make up lies. Hey, I did not hey. say <laughs> You are a bus driver. <laughs> bring them out. Bring them out. Bring them out. Bring them out. It's hard to yell when the bat rails in your mouth. Woo! Bring them out, bring them out. Behind the stage of Money Is event, and I'm changing colors on my team, teal color to a black and Kelly green color. And so I thought for my A team that what would be cool was if we did like a uniform, but because of my personal team, instead of making them look like those guys, I'm gonna go with like a Louis Vuitton Kelly green package. The first one here is for Haley. I'm gonna have him wear uh, all of these. Matter of fact, Zoe's got hers on right now. She went with a little bit bigger one because she just shoots a lot of video. Haley, show another thing you have. She already has this piece, which is funny, but it actually just holds all the cards to our like staff room here, my room, etc. Louis Vuitton, Kelly Green, belts right here. Gabe, come here. Gabe already has his on. Look at this. Look at that. Black, green, black, green. Oh, shit. <laughs> Last one's for Tim. He's behind the camera, so look at this one. Wow. It's gonna be a badass A team. Now I heard, I heard, I heard, I heard. For Aspire, I'm gonna do it again, but I'm gonna do hot pink, and I think Gucci just released a hot pink uh, set. So Aspire A team will be black with hot pink Gucci. Money is a team will be black with Kelly Green. You should join the team. I mean, shit, that's like 20 grand worth of gifts for these guys. I'm like, where's mine? Zan is famous for wearing medium shirts, like very, very tight, 
like he gets it from the female section and then puts them on. And he finally wore a shirt that fits him. Normally it looks like they painted the shirts on him. That break into the restroom and when I came out, it was a, a father and two sons. The boys were nine and 11 years old and they've been here for this class. And then I found out it was his 11 year old's birthday today. Come up here, Benny, come up here, buddy. You good? When we were outside, do you remember what I said to remember about money? I said to remember that it's always yours. And nobody cares. More about it than you. That's right. And I also noticed my boys got dunks on. On that note, Benny, I got your birthday present, my man. Uh, Tabby, come out here. <clears throat> the crowd wants to do one more thing for you. You ready? You're 11, right? Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 Happy birthday, dear Ben. At this event I'm at right now, it's the Money is Master Class that came from the Aspire event. On this moment, on stage there, I asked people to join our master class, our mastermind. And we're about to sign up over $1.7 million at this moment in this class at $15,000 per person. And even in that room, what I'm trying to do right there is position it where you can come and join. And I'm not here to network with everybody. They position themselves to be in this room. They position themselves to be in this community. And now we're gonna go see what it, uh, takes place in their business and in my business. Positioning is attracting something. Networking is uh, going after something. And if you can decide which one you are, I always use attraction over uh, chasing. With a whole lot of diamonds to shawty, shawty, my time. Took a trip out to Cali to hang with the Chris, make a play and get high off that Zaza.